Let's start. This question reads, a 32-year-old woman is admitted to the hospital after a complaining of urinary frequency, dysuria, and weakness. She is not sexually active, and her LMP last menstrual period was one week ago. Costovertebral angle tenderness is elicited. IPCEF triaxone is started. Two days later, the patient is afebril and feels much better. Antibiotic susceptibility testing showed E. coli highly sensitive to ceftriaxone, gentamicin, ciprofloxacin, and TMP SMX. Which of the following is the best step in the management of this patient? You can pause the video, read the question, answer it, then come back for the correct answer and explanation. Okay, so the correct answer here is switch to TMP SMX. Initially, this patient has signs and symptoms suggestive of uncomplicated pyelonephritis, which responded well to parenteral antibiotic therapy. Patients with uncomplicated pyelonephritis can usually be switched to an oral antibiotic. After 48 to 72 hours of parenteral therapy, the most reasonable step would be to switch to an antibiotic, according to the susceptibility testing. TMP SMX is a good choice because it is relatively cheap and she can continue on TMP SMX for two weeks. There is no reason to add another antibiotic or continue parenteral agents, which would require hospitalization.